Hey everybody, this is Tom Arbor and welcome back to Hingeback Tortoise Central. If you'd like to follow us along on our adventure as we raise and breed Hingeback Tortoises, please don't forget to subscribe. And tonight is super exciting because guess what? We have we a... Have, wait, let me see it, Dad. We have a new tortoise. How did we get a new tortoise? We hatched one. One's hatching right now. A new baby Holmes Hinchback tortoise is hatching right now, and this is a partnership between myself and David Mifsud up in Michigan. And this is the second Homiana that we've hatched with Dave's five animals that I have on loan. We are super happy to work with Dave and be a part uh, of this project where we're partnering to produce Holmes Hinchbacks in captivity. So let's go take a look. Carefully open yep. it. So guys, there he is, he's hatching. Hard to see him in detail, but we'll let him hatch and we'll get back with you when he is out of the egg. Super exciting. Okay guys, it's about three hours later and we're gonna check on that baby tortoise and see how it's doing. Oh yeah, he's coming. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is take that egg and put it in a brooder box in another incubator and let him hatch away from the other eggs. A little baby tortoise. Well guys, there he is. He's hatching. This one has a much, much bigger yolk sac than Spike. He's got his eyes closed. Um, but how cool is that? Um, this tortoise. What's interesting is the egg was actually oriented this way, and uh, oh, there's opening his eyes. So the egg was like this, so we actually hatched kind of sideways. Uh, oh, that is so cool. So, so cool. Bringing a new life into this world, a new home cinch back. Hey guys, it's Tom again. It's about an hour and a half later. The tortoise got set up in the brooder box and I just checked on him and he's completely out of the egg. Let's go take a look. He'll unfold. You can see he's, he's kind of tilted upwards. He's got lots of yolk sac left that he'll absorb. He'll flatten out and he won't be so round. He looks tiny compared to our, our other tortoise. And just how cool is this? So, wow guys, you gotta take a look at this. Um, here is a little baby tortoise. He's still got a fold. So that, you know, he's folded inside the egg. He will unfold and um, he'll flatten out and he'll absorb that yolk sac. But man, how cool is this? A brand new little baby tortoise. This never gets old. It's so cool. We will check back on this little guy tomorrow morning. Have a good night, buddy. Good morning, it's six o'clock in the morning and let's check out our baby home cinch back and see how it did and changed overnight. So wow guys, she is so much different. Um, Look how much smaller that yolk sac is. And the fold is completely gone. Wow. That's just amazing. Uh, what a cool little tortoise. Um, yep. He's feisty too. Just such a neat little guy. Here is Spike. Um, he's quite a bit bigger. It's just so cool to put out these little baby tortoises. Guys, it is Thursday evening, so it's been about 48 hours since the baby was born. And guess what? Another baby tortoise was born. So we have two Holmes Hinchbacks, right Weston? Yep. I'm so excited because my dad, since this guy will, is actually, since I'm gonna be taking on the next generation, it's gonna let me raise Chef Jeffrey. 
And that's right, Chef Jeffrey is one of the tortoises. And look, here's Paigey. What do you see? Baby turtles. Yep. The baby turtles are so cute. Aren't they? You want to help yes. us? Okay, Weston. So guys, today what we're going to do is give them their first soak. Weston, just gently place them in the water, okay? Okay. Let's see how their yolk sacs are. So that one is Chef Jeffrey. He started... Ooh, it's really starting yeah. to get small. That's yeah, really small. So like, it was like really big. Yep. So we'll say hi to give him a soak. In there. Okay. And then the next one is Bob. Yep. This is Chef Jeffrey. Chef Jeffrey. Yep. Mine. Mine. And this and is Bob, um, Dave's tortoise. Uh, what's his full name, Dad? Dave M Mifsud. Right, those. Okay, so it's a little bigger than his. Mm -hmm. So that'll take a little bit more time. And now we're just experiencing water for the first time. Mm -hmm. Aren't they so cute? They're so adorable. So yeah, guys, because I have these tortoises on loan from Dave Mifsud, we alternate offspring. So the first one that was born was Spike, and that one's mine, and the next one is Dave's, and then the next one was mine. So in, in total, we've got three Holmes Hinchbacks that we've hatched this season. And hopefully, it's, it's, it's been a good season. It's our first yeah. season that we've had success. And hopefully, 2020 is going to be a good year. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, we reach 100K. Let's do that. <laughs> and so, hopefully, we'll have one hatch in the next few days. But for now, what an exciting week. Uh, bringing two more tortoises. Active, alive, happy, excited. Tortoises. I don't think they understand the meaning of that. Yeah, I don't think they either. <laughs> but um, we love this. It's just so awesome. We love this. We love what we do. We love the tortoises. We love taking care of them. It's just something we do, and we absolutely love it. Aww. And Paige loves it too. Right, Paigey? So guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you'd like to follow us along on our journey as we Hatch more hingeback tortoises. Yeah. Thank you very much and go hingebacks. Yeah.